All right, so example five. Find the limit of the function f of x, which equals x cubed plus cosine five x divided by ten thousand as x approaches zero. All right, so this is an interesting one. All right, so let's say we gotta do we gotta do the same thing we've been doing, which is using this calculator and table to plug in values, right? So we plug in some values for our function. So let me just put f of x. So I'll write it all out. And so let's say we put one. It's gonna be one point zero 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 something. I don't want to worry about that. Alright, so we go down, we keep plugging numbers. And what we're trying to do, we're trying to approach zero. So let's say I put point zero one. And so what this function is gonna give us, it's gonna give us zero 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 one zero one. And so it appears that this function is approaching zero, right? No. If we kept plugging in numbers, so let's say we plug in point zero zero one and let's say we keep going, keep going, it's gonna end up giving us one divided by ten thousand. Alright, and so what's happening is that no matter what number you put in, we keep putting numbers in, it's going to be approximately 1 divided by 10,000. It's crazy, huh? That it looks like it's approaching 0, but it actually approaches this number. And so this is a valuable lesson for us. It's easy for us to guess the wrong value when using calculators. And this is really um, not really trustworthy, you know? But at the same time, we're not going to do it by hand and by your head, right? Because that takes too long. And so later in the future, we're going to develop foolproof methods for calculating limits. And so what that means is we're going to develop ideas that allow us to get to this number here, right? This number here without having to to plug in so many different kinds of numbers into our function and guess because guessing just takes too much time. And so we learn we learn the derivatives. We learned that in a couple of chapters.